Hi guys, you're here with Denitra, and right now I'm going to show you some things I've been working on. <coughs> um, today I made this card, um, and it's an S fold card. Let me adjust the camera a little bit. It's kind of too close. Just adjusting the camera. Okay, that looks better. Okay, um, this is an S-Load card, and this card is inspired by Mary. Hi, Mary. Um, she did a card, a Christmas card, that said joy, and I scrapped lifted um, the whole card, actually, <laughs> um, from the sentiment um, and on. But I did it a little differently. I actually cut off about an inch. I cut in a half inch off at the top and another half inch at the bottom after I had folded it all. And instead of leaving this flap right here open usually this this will open up I adhered it down on the bottom and the side and I made a little pull out tag um so that this is can be a gift that will keep on giving when you give the card they have a tag that they can put on a gift whoever you give the card to and um the tag measures one and seven eighths by six inches. Let me make sure of that. Yeah, one and seven eighths by six inches is the whole tag. And I use my crocodile and set my eyelet, which I'm loving the crocodile. And um, it just slides back in there. So so cute. Um, this pattern here, this pattern paper here, is actually gift wrapping paper. Um, you know how your kids bring home the, um, the catalogs for, like, um, the fundraisers and things? And then you have the sample wallpaper in the back of it? Well, I just took it off. And that's what I use for that. I know it, that's really recycling, but I felt that it could be used, so I used it. Um, and I just put, I uh, used my two-way glue pen and added some glitter. And then on my letters, I embossed them with white, um, pigment ink. And then I, um embossed it with clear ink um and these are chipboard letters and I popped them up with some foam and I just sprinkled a little glitter um on it like from high up I just like threw it down to make it look sprinkly and um open it up it's very plain it's just some white paper to write your sentiment and then um just a joy stamp here so I hope you guys like this card very cute it took me three minutes to tell you about this card, so let's move on. Um, these two cards are baby cards. Um, that's for a girl, and then obviously for the boy. And this card is a three-panel card from Angie. Um, and she's at Chicken Scratch on here on YouTube. And um, the boy one I did um backwards, and the sentiment says, "Congratulations on your new bundle of joy. I hope." Parenthood brings you the best of happiest times. Babies are a gift from God, so handle with care and love, and you are sure to reap the most wonderful reward in the end. And I just typed that sentiment up on um, Word and put it in here. And it's so cute. And this pattern paper is from the Boy Just Chilling 6x6 um, six six paper pad from Making Memories. I love that paper. It's so cute. And here's the button. And I stamped the deer from Dear Friends. Um, that's a Stampin' Up stamp set. And I just layered it like she did in the video. Um, yeah, just like she did. And that's inside. And then the girls, um, baby card. It says the same thing on the inside, but I had, I added a little rattle. And, um, it's purple to match. And there's a button. And the rabbit is also from Dear Friend Stamp Set. So cute. Um, what else? Okay, and since I had some paper left over from the 6x6 pad, I just made a simple masculine birthday card. Very, very simple. And just says happy birthday, and I printed that from Microsoft Word. Um, very, I mean, can't get no simpler than that, right? Okay, and this card I made last night. It's an anniversary card. And um, this is a big chipboard piece that I embossed with black ink and clear embossing powder. <clears throat> and 
Then I just added a pearl every other scallop. I used my crocodile to um to do my holes and thread some ribbon through. And happy anniversary comes from um word I printed it off. <clears throat> and then I layered it. Um, this ticket shape is from um I welded in um Design Studio um for my Cricut and um folded in half. And then the sentiment is an original sentiment by me, um, just like the uh, baby cards. And it says, life with you has been a ticket to heaven. I am so happy that our love will never expire. With all my soul and my entire mind, I love you. And I put the little pearl here um, on top of the brad. And then this piece here is left for um, whoever to write a nice sentiment to their wife or girlfriend. Um, I thought this was really cute. And I'm going to do um, happy anniversary for him. This one is obviously for her. And um, it'll probably be black and blue, maybe. I'm not sure. Um, I really like this card. <laughs> I really like the sentiment. Um, it just came to me with the ticket shape and then the saying. I just thought that it went together. So, um, that's this one. And I made, um, these are gift card holders or money holders. Um, and Angie from Chicken Scratch, Chicken Scratch, she did something similar to this, but I changed it up, um, in the fact that it's not the same size, and because, um, I made, I handmade my envelope and put it in there, and then I think she had, like, two pockets, but this can be just for money or just for a gift card, and then you can write, you know, to you from me. And then, um, those are leaves that are stamped, and I added just a little glitter, um, can't see the shimmer. I can, but there's a little bit, okay? And these are the leaves, and, um, that just fits down like that. And then, um, this is another one that's, um, just skinnier, um, well, actually a lot smaller. Um, and a little thinner, so, and it's done the same way. I used the envelope that I made myself, and I'll show you guys how I make my envelopes. And you can see the glitter on this one, the gold. I really like it, it feels good too. And I ink the edges, so, and that's that. And I think that's it. Wow, I showed you guys everything. Alright, so, um, those are some things that I've made. Oh, and I made this using a YouTube tutorial from, um, Ozum Nurse, I think it is, her YouTube name, and, um, I wanted to make this when I first saw the video, but I couldn't, because I didn't have a copper dial to go through the coasters, but since I have it now, I, I made one, and, um, I like it, it's, it's pretty big, but I do like it, so, um, there's an update on some stuff that I've been working on, I hope you guys like everything, and, um, I'll be back with a tutorial today on a tag that will match this this masculine card because I had some paper left over and I'm going to use it up and I'm going to show you guys how I make my envelopes and how I um how I made these okay so thanks for watching this video and thanks for everybody um that inspired to make these um these cards and things that I've got that I've made um and I'll be back shortly with another video all right thanks